Here at the Office of Consumer Protection, we give Scam Buster Awards to residents who bring a consumer scam to our attention, and in some cases, help us solve them. I'm here with Shapong Chen, who recently uncovered a scam. Welcome, Mr. Chen. Can you tell us what happened? Yes. Uh, so I was, uh, I was sent a track from Kroger the grocery store for a job called uh, Mystery Shopper. Can you tell us what a Mystery Shopper is? Right. So uh, in, the, in the letter that I got, the, my duty for the uh, Mystery Shopper is to uh, experience their competitors uh, and then report to the company and they'll give me $400 as a, a, a compensation. In fact, Kroger's did not send the email or the check, but its name was used to get Mr. Chen to respond. Here's how the scam works. The letter instructed him to deposit the check, in this case for $2,650 into his checking account. He was asked to keep some of the money, send some to a children's charity, purchase merchandise as part of the mystery shopper assignment, and then send the rest and money orders to another mystery shopper. But there were some red flags that prohibited Mr. Chen from taking the bait. So uh, I read a letter with the duty and uh, also with the track, and I figured uh, the letter was not written in a, in a good English. I found a lot of uh, grammar error uh, right there. And then I secondary, I look on the uh, on, on, on Google, so um, search for mystery shoppers, and to my surprise, uh, the fourth thread uh, on the search result is uh, from US Today uh, reporting the same scam. So um, I immediately recognized this, this must be a scam. But this is not a, the most difficult part. Uh, the most of the difficult part is to uh, resist the temptation of the money. <laughs> it's, a, it's, a, it's, a, it's, it's a very good money, so I can use it for something else. So then uh, I talked to my friend, uh, too, and, and he, he told me this is definitely a scam and confirmed my, my, my suspicious theory. Ultimately, the check is fake and the consumer is accountable to the bank. No legitimate business will pay in advance or ask you to send back a portion of the money. Mr. Chen contacted us in order to prevent others from falling for the scam. So Mr. Chen, for your efforts, our office would like to award you with the Montgomery County Office of Consumer Protection Scam Buster Award. Thank you so much. Thank you. Please remember that money does not magically come in the mail. Be cautious of offers and opportunities that seem too good to be true. Do not be forced or scared to giving any money. If you think what you've received is a scam, you can call the Office of Consumer Protection's phone line at 240-777-3636 or contact us online.